So here at Tetronix, we get asked a lot of questions. One of the most popular questions is how do you measure current within oscilloscope? So typically oscilloscopes are set up to measure voltage, voltage versus time. Well, you can actually use two methods to measure current. Method one, which is via channel one, is actually measuring the voltage drop across a shunt resistor on my board here. I've changed a few of the settings from standard. Firstly, I've lowered the bandwidth to reduce any system noise. Secondly, I've told the scope, you're no longer measuring voltage, you're actually gonna be measuring current now. So please use amps as the unit of measurement, which I've done there. And as you can see on my measurement badge, I've got about 1.9 amps um, peak to peak. Method two, which is via channel two, is actually making use of a current probe, a dedicated probe designed and made to measure current. Uh, some probes can measure DC and AC, some can only measure AC. This particular one can actually measure both and up to a maximum frequency of 120 megahertz, very useful. Um, this measurement is giving me 1.8 amps, so relatively close to what the voltage drop across the shunt resistor is displaying. So there you have it, two methods on how to measure current with an oscilloscope. Thanks. Find out more at Viacom's website.